In this tutorial, I will show you how to make a mapping guide of your house. This guide is useful if you are designing your own projection mapping show or want to send a map of your house to a designer. We will be making the mapping guide quickly and easily using LumaMap Lite, which is a free application from LumaBox. First, you need to connect your projector to your computer and have it set up as an extended or external display in your display settings. If you're not sure how to do this, check out the links in the description. Head up to the menu and go to Output, choose Display and make sure your projector is selected from the list. Confirm that the output resolution shown matches the resolution of your projector. Click Send to Display. Then enable Whiteout. Your projector should now be outputting white light. Use this to position your projector so white light hits all the areas you want to projection map. Move further back if your projector isn't covering enough of your surface. Move further forward if you are wasting lots of pixels around the edges of your surface. Try to find that sweet spot. When you've found your ideal projector position, Take a photo of your house from as close to the projector's lens as possible. Make sure that all your surfaces are in the photo. This method of projection mapping works best if the projector is close to perpendicular with the projection surface and there isn't a lot of perspective in the photo. Transfer the image to your computer using your preferred method. Import the photo into LumaMap. Disable Whiteout. Now is a good time to make sure your projector is focused on the house. Move the corner handles so the reference photo matches onto the physical house. This process takes a little practice. You'll notice that moving one corner handle affects the lineup of the whole image. I recommend making rough alignments at first and gradually dialing in the mapping through smaller and smaller adjustments. You can also use outline mode to help you do this. When the reference photo matches onto the physical house, you are finished. You now have a projector's eye view. This is your mapping guide. Leave your guide as a photo or switch into outlines if you prefer. You can export the image by clicking Export Image. The image will be the same resolution as your projector. You can use this mapping guide to build your own projection show in other software or send it to a designer. You might be wondering what this AI button does. These features are locked in LumaMap Lite, but in the full paid version of LumaMap, it launches the AI generator and art tools. They enable you to produce creative facades at the click of a button. This might help you get a jumpstart on your own DIY show, or enable you to provide a show designer with bespoke assets to work with when building a show for you. It works by combining your mapped photo with an imaginative text prompt. Then the AI generator will produce a unique facade that you can preview straight onto your house. Use the handy art tools to give the generator even more to work with and bring your vision to life. If you want to integrate AI into your projection mapping workflow, but don't have the time or know-how to get started, LumaMap might be the beginner-friendly, all-in-one tool that you're looking for.